What's up, cool kids? Today on Vector Line, we're talking YouTube Red. Also, we're considering the death of broadcast television. Mmm, check it out. Hi, I'm Braden. I'm Craig. Welcome to Crossing the Vector Line. The show that talks about the rules of filmmaking and how to creatively break them. Mm. Today we're talking YouTube Red. It's Red Dawn. For YouTube. What does that mean exactly? I'm still trying to figure it out. I think it's a cool concept. Yes. I'm kind of excited. So it's, it's an ad-free service. Subscription. Subscription. 10 bucks a month, yeah. but no commercials at all. Yep. Exclusive content. Mm. Downloadable playlists that you can watch offline. Yep. All some pretty neat features. What's the biggest feature that we're most excited about though? Drum roll. YouTube is teaming up with premium YouTube content creators such as like mm. PewDiePie yep. to create awesome content for new shows, ideas, stories, things like yeah. that. So example, yeah. PewDiePie is teaming up with The Walking Dead type show Weird to create this whole awesome zombie yeah. thing, and it's all being funded through YouTube Red. I signed up for this, so I'm okay. But really, I'm, I'm not okay. Yeah, Pretty this awesome. is, I think, the, the part that I'm the most excited about. You know, Netflix has finally gotten into their rhythm as far as creating great original content, bypassing all the networks and all that. YouTube is trying to do the same thing. Absolutely. And they're starting with a recipe of success. They're starting with stuff they know works. Right. They know that people are already tuning in to check these guys out. Right giving them the budget, giving them the means to create some pretty cool stuff. Now, I was a little bit hesitant at first because I was worried. I was like, okay, well then my favorite channels, I'm not gonna have access to that normal content. That's not that's not the case. You're still gonna have access to all the same stuff. Yep. There's just gonna be some additional content yep. that's gonna be only available to YouTube Red subscribers. Yep. You wanna level up that YouTube content. <laughs> Plus, the ad-free, I mean, we can't like skip right over that. It's a beautiful that's, thing. That's one of the things that is super annoying about, about YouTube, let's be honest. Totally especially those non-skippable ads, you've got to sit through 30 seconds of garbage. Yes. Is that worth 10 bucks a month? It is if you're a Google Music subscriber. YouTube Red comes with that subscription. I just recently found that out last night, actually. I pulled up YouTube, I updated the app on my phone, it says YouTube Red. I was like, hold You'll the phone, what's going on? I was Red. like, is this an ad for YouTube? No, it comes with it. 10 bucks a month for Google Music and YouTube Red, that's mm. a deal right there. Ad-free music and videos all day, every day. Yes, sir, sign Yeah, up. And being able to take content offline to watch later, I think is huge. I'm not oh, sure yeah. exactly how that's gonna work, especially on a mobile device, but I'm excited about that. But great for traveling, airplanes, yeah. airports, the kids giving that so they're not blowing through your data all the time. Yep. You download it over Wi-Fi, hand it to the kids. I mean, that'd be awesome right there. Yep. I don't even have kids, but. You know, My kids, they here. just watch so much YouTube. All of it, all the time. Actually, all the time. No. It's a good deal. But this Not is a pretty solid move by YouTube. Definitely staying relatable up, up in the top with Hulu and Netflix and all the other online video services. Yeah, so I I'm, think YouTube will be seeing green by going red. Mm, wait, like Christmas? Ooh, it's like so a the, Christmas color. Do we I mean, happy Christmas. Well done, to YouTube. To you. Well done. Right after this, we're going to be talking broadcast television. Awesome or dying? Keep it going, keep it going. Now you can cut. This episode is brought to you by Podium, the online and mobile CRM tool that helps you organize your everyday work. It's fast, easy to use, and completely customizable. It's also great for collaborating with your team. Assign tasks, add comments to files, and have discussions right there in Podio. Check them out at podio.com. So I'm no videologist, I don't mean to be a Debbie Downer here, but I believe that broadcast television is dead. It's dead. It's dead. It's gone. When was the last time you thought, oh, I've got to tune in at seven o'clock on channel eight to watch my favorite show? So, the answer is never. So are you saying it's been killed by like online, like yes. Hulu, Netflix, I mean, Yeah, YouTube? we're talking about Netflix, we're talking about YouTube now creating original content. I couldn't tell you the last time that I watched my favorite show on TV. I'm totally okay to watch it online, totally okay to even wait until it comes to Netflix because I want to watch it in quick succession and I want to watch it without commercials. That's a good point, but you're going to be watching it a day later for the vast majority of a lot of TV shows. It's available online the next day. So you don't get to be the first look at the new premiere episode, the new season premiere. You're, you're, you're not on board with that. Plus, everyone's Least favorite thing in the entire world is spoilers. 
Yes. So I wake up the next morning, I'm checking my my social stream, and then I see a spoiler for Game of Thrones, and I'm like, mm, man, if I had just watched it on TV last night, I could have had that. I can see that. And it ruined it. Plus, I just, I just like, go on Thursday a Facebook night, fast. What's the, what's, the, what's the thing they have for like Thursday night? That's like from like 6 to 11 o'clock, there's like all these shows. People go crazy. It's like Thursday night, I have to be home, I have to catch up okay, on but, all my But my, let's my let's admit, and there are studies that have been done, the, the amount of viewership for all your basic network shows has been drastically declining over the last year. It's like 30%, which is tens of thousands of viewers less. are totally okay to wait that next day or wait when Netflix finally carries it. Yet you still Dang. have several million other people who are tuning in well, they on need a to weekly get on basis. Board. They need to get on board with the yeah, digital revolution. Yeah, so I would definitely say everything is going online. It's, true. it's not dead, but I'd say it's on the decline. It's terminally ill. Yeah, it's bleeding out. Sorry, TV. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. But I'm no video I'm really sorry. Let us know what you think of YouTube Red. Cool idea? Good Are you idea. worried about it? Concerns? What kind of shows are you looking forward to? What kind of YouTuber would you love to see make some exclusive Definitely, content? yeah, definitely check it out and see what who your favorite people are teaming up with like to make us? some new stuff. Make yeah. some new stuff? Mm -hmm. Hi, YouTube Red. YouTube, hey We're here. Hey We're here. We'll We're here. see you guys waiting. next week on Crossing the Vector Line. Check it! Bye! <laughs> Hey, cool kids, today we're talking YouTube Red. Mm. What does that mean? They're angry? They're like very emotional, upset, Just some kind, red in the face. Embarrassed. Let's do that again. Okay.